Okay, so in this lesson we're going to be learning about variables, and I'm going to go pretty quick because, well, it's about 12 o'clock again, and I feel like going to sleep, so, public class variables. Okay, we're actually going to make the entire class this time rather than just editing part of it. Uh, public static void main. Now, don't really worry about what the top of main, the little, uh, God, what is this called? Um, I don't know, main header is saying it's, uh, you don't really need to worry about that right now. Uh, let's make another method. Notice we started the same way, public static void. Uh, integers. And I'll show you guys a little bit about integers. I'm going to compile now just to make sure I haven't typed anything wrong. Uh, uh, make sure when you type everything, you're remembering that Java is case sensitive. That uh, if you type this with lowercase, this has to be lowercase. Uh, it's standard practice to make the first letter of a class name capitalized. Okay. It compiles well, so we never know everything's working. Um, let's see, in integers, let's make new variables. Uh, int a. There are different ways of assigning values. You can do immediately do int a equals 1 or int b make the variable and then say b equals 2 or uh, you can also do make multiple variables at once you can do like c equals 3 and then also make a d variable and d equals 4 and you see you can do a whole bunch of things like that and just combine these different methods but uh... int all lowercase it's important um... you can do many math commands with them uh... a equals b plus c and that will make a equal to let's see b is two c is three so it's gonna be five uh, or a equals b minus c, it's going to be negative 1, it's going to be 6. That is going to be 0, and I'll show you that this is all true here. I recognize this format. This is another method. This method prints stuff to the screen. Uh, as we learned about methods in the last chapter, uh, this can be any variable that you have. You can put in print them. Um, Okay, let's try this. There you go. See, just like I said, uh, A initially was 1, B plus C is 5, B minus C is negative 1, uh, E times the other, E at 6. But because they're integers, they cannot hold decimal values. So, any time you divide, you've got to make sure that you're dividing two of the next variable I'm about to show you, which is called a double.
Okay, see, and because these are different methods, I can actually have two variables that are the same name. Like, if I tried to do... Here. Let's just comment this out for right now. I've got to remember not to make any variables the same name. That'll cause an error. You probably can't even compile. Yeah, see, it finds the error right there. Just got to remember that uh, you can only have one variable to each name in each bracket. Uh, you'll figure this out if you just mess around a little bit. You'll find out different errors, things you can and can't do. Okay. Uh, five divided by seven. Okay. And now we'll print out all these variables. and we'll do doubles. Okay. You might look in this and see, well, A was 9.5, B was 12.5, but C, I thought we made this a double. So we go down, well, we did make C a double, but these are still integers because they don't have any decimal points. So if we make this 5.0, uh, close this, Recompile, rerun, and there you go. There's actually 5 divided by 7. Because if either one of these is a double, then it will divide as a double. If it's not, then uh, it'll divide as integers, and you'll end up with an integer value rather than a double value. Uh, let's see. Oh, mixing integers and... doubles. Uh, see, normally, if you have a variable, you can do this. But because they're of different types, you can't put something that has decimal pe decimals into a variable that does not have decimals. And I'm sure you can see why. But what you can do is cut off the decimals. And that's called casting. You uh, change here. It is this little symbol right here. Parentheses and int in between. You can do this with any type of variable that you want to cast differently. Uh, if you want to change it to a different type of variable. I think it'll work with most any type of variable. Oh, I didn't print it out. Okay, and you see it doesn't round. It wouldn't, doesn't change 9.5 to 10. Uh, it just cuts off the end. So even if this was 9.9, .9, it would still be 9. Okay, and that's about it for doubles. Oh, uh, just so you know, you can also do grouping. Like, you can say A equals B plus C plus C divided by 12.5. don't know why you do that, but... Uh, as you can see, this isn't a very useful program, but 